This is beautifully made. Like this thing is just awesome. Yeah. Cool. Heavy. These are metal too. Like it's well made. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Do so need anything is plug in right here. Boom. Let's uh let's plug it in. All right. Puzzle Time, episode 63. Nice. Yeah. So today we have, we have some wood, lots of wood stuff. Yep. Yeah. Let's uh, let's start with a giveaway though. We have a giveaway. We are gonna give away, bum ba da bum. The rotor. The rotor. Cast nice. rotor from Hanayama. If you like Hanayama, you will like this puzzle. Mm -hmm. Have you, uh, have, we, have we shot this one? I think we did. I think we did, yep. Yeah. This is a like two piece puzzle that is somehow a level like it's six really here, hard 10. man i've played for this with with this one for a while. yeah i've actually there's the honey i'm a puzzle enthusiast group on facebook and lots of people have commented about this puzzle and they're like how is a two-piece puzzle this hard but it is and yeah, like it's weird yeah so good puzzle we're gonna give it away get yours for free we will ship it to you um no cost like this video comment yeah we like need comments, comment. that's what it is. Like you and can't comment. see who likes this video, so make sure you comment. Yeah, so comment, you'll, uh, we'll do, yeah, we'll pick the winner out of that and you'll you'll win a cast rotor. Also, we have done uh, the 100 likes challenge before. Episode 55. Okay. Yeah, didn't work, didn't get the 100 likes, so. But, we did get 25, and uh, Puzzle Guy has been just, hounding us to get this this going he wants to do this he wants to see us do puzzles in a hot tub loser jumps in the snow that's it gotta do it while there's still snow okay now if you guys could really hurry on this and like <laughs> this coming weekend i mean this video is probably not gonna be out in time yeah so give us 75 likes here on episode 63 and we will We'll do Mine this challenge. We're 25 and we're at 100. Yeah. So if you want to see us in like minus 31 degree Celsius temperatures, playing with puzzles in a hot tub, loser jumps into the snow. Yeah. We need to figure out what puzzle we're going to do. Yeah. An easy one. Yeah. Give us a, yeah, just vote below. Yeah, maybe. Give us a section. Dude, maybe in the comments, right when you're entering for the <laughs> rotor today. Yeah. Let us know what puzzle we should do in the hot tub. Absolutely. And then click like. We can get, we can, we can just. Kill a whole bunch of birds with go. one stone, win a puzzle, get the 100 likes challenge, torture us in the snow. Make a video. Tony will lose. You'll see him jump in the snow. I'm not good. Guaranteed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go on to the puzzles. Let's jump in. Should we start with the, oh, with start one. small? Start All small. Right. This is the Overtime Puzzle Box Series 2 Skull. Long name. Gotta be. Cool puzzle. Um, it's a level nine. It's from Creative Craft House. So level nine is almost the most difficult. So it's a pretty almost. difficult puzzle. You can see here the, um, well, there's a solution. Oh. Right here. Solution to it. Don't, uh, I don't want to cheat and look there. at that, but yeah. Now let's just pause here actually. So we've got this puzzle box. Looks really cool. We have another one from is this technically it's creative, craft, creative house. craft house? Yeah. It's kind of creative craft house. So kind of puzzle master. <laughs> kind of puzzle master too. So what's this one called? Do you know? The latch box. Latch box. There we go. Yeah. So you'll recognize the puzzle on the front of this because it is one of ours. It's the trick lock seven. Trick lock number seven. So it was actually quite a popular puzzle and still is. So really good little oh. trick lock. Ah, Tony. Okay. This pause okay. out okay. a sec. Okay, so we've got this. There's a story behind this puzzle box. Um, Leon, my father, he uh, orders some of our puzzles and he was ordering from Creative Craft House and decided one day, I'm just gonna order that box. It looks cool. Ordered it, 
Tony like got it in. 300 of them, man. Like, he doesn't <laughs> want many? a small order. Oh. Yeah, there's probably 50. There's a lot. But, like, okay, there whatever. so many. And, Tony, you opened them, right? Yeah. And what... They did it not... It the didn't, first puzzle I ever solved. It, it was nice. It didn't come with this lock. And, uh, here, let me just... Let me just... Uh, off camera, I'll open the lock here and we'll... We'll show kind of what... All right, can I open it? Am I going to be able to open it? Yeah, okay, it's good. Whatever. Um, I'm not going to get it off. But, so essentially, it's not a puzzle box. It's just like it's this latch, latch opened up and opened. And so, we're like, this really isn't a puzzle. It's just kind of a cool box that's well made. So we added a tricky lock. So Alan, your dad. Oh yeah. Saved the day. Saved the day. Added a trick lock. Now you have a really sweet puzzle. That's kind of two puzzles in one. Mm -hmm. So you get the trick lock seven, get this box. Um, but that's a bit of the story behind it. So, Good. yeah, there you go. Okay, back to OT. OT. Overtime box. <gasps> Tony, you got one of the pieces Dude, out. Dude, look at, look at how much is happening. What? Here. I don't know. <gasps> you opened it? I'm so amazing at this. <laughs> you don't even know how you did it, but you opened it. What the? Oh, look at that. So it has a little latch that like, these are latched down here. Yeah, there's a little yeah, hook right there under be. there. And it hooks in and right just there. just it to the side. Oh, man, Tony's a genius. Doesn't even know how though. It worked out today. Okay, well, you saw that. You saw how it opened up. Tony, you won't know the solution though, because Tony really just kind of stumbled ass backwards into it, so. Well, <laughs> but. Somewhere, it's stuck now though. <laughs> you screw, oh, okay. You screwed it up. No, I think it has something to do. Well, obviously, it does have something to do with these. So you, the one comes out though, and it's like a key almost looking thing. Oh yeah, I did get this key out. Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, but okay. it's got so it's got this engraved skull with a little like. What is that even? Looks like a bee. Bee with a light with bulb a light on the bulb? end. I don't know. Steampunk stuff, right? There it is. OT box series two skull. Tony mostly. Almost. Solved kind of solved it. it. <laughs> I got it one step backwards and can't figure it out now. There you go. Man, you are on some kind of a streak here with like solving Accident stuff. Accidentally solving things. Yeah, you've yeah. just been been solving things left and right here. So yeah, there it is. Sick. It's well made. I don't know what kind of wood this is, but it's got a nice little finish on it. It's good. All the edges line up. That's yep. all we're asking Exactly, for. exactly. So creative craft out. Oh, my key just fell out. <laughs> <laughs> but I, yeah, I assume this is some sort of Morse code, hey? It looks like it. Yeah. But oh, also. Wow, dude, that's uh, the ones that line up, eh? Oh. Yeah, oh. Show that one. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, there it is. The skull and the. Um, what was this one called again? Latch box. Latch box. There you go. Latch box. If you haven't got that lock, man, check it out. Okay. Let's go on to the big one. Oh, yeah. Oh, got a big one. Now, you've seen this puzzle on Chris Ramsey's channel before. It's called the Tesla box. We have it here at Puzzle Master. It is made by Andy Gilker, who's an engineer. Um, as I think lots of these guys are, they're usually pretty genius guys that make, make these puzzles. It does plug in. So I've got a cord here. Let's see. All right, before we get there. Yeah, yeah, you wanna show lights? it? Okay, right, I'll we hold got that. three lights there. We got a dial. Yeah, the old and it works. phone rotor, and it's heavy. Like yeah. it's, it's actually heavy, which it's I thought was cool. Off of an actual phone. We got three switches. Yeah, and a key. A key that is stuck in the puzzle. Yeah. Well. Oh, kinda. Oh man. Okay. All right. That's it. <laughs> That's it. All right. That's the puzzle, and it's it's called the Tesla's Puzzle Box. It's and a level eight on the Puzzle Master difficulty the goal is scale. To light up all of the light bulbs. Yes, well, I think the goal is—I don't know if there's all of them—is is to get this thing lit up. Okay. So it's like grab that Tesla card. box. Yeah, grab the, no, 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 this one. Okay. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Before you get there, well, yeah, sure. Let's do it. Sure. Let's jump into this. So it's got this old-timey newspaper thing. The old post. City. City is plunged into darkness. Electricity has abruptly stopped last night, and the O in stopped is capitalized. And the T, yeah, yeah. When the T. Nikola Tesla is testing free electricity. So there's a whole story behind this. Cool. Really neat. It's got, oh, 90 minutes to solve. One, one to, to three, three people, people, moderate difficulty. Ooh. Tesla's box right there. So yeah, you gotta get the little Tesla thing that light up and it, it does a word like follow the electricity, follows your finger. It nice. does. I saw, I watched it as Chris did it. 
Okay. I didn't watch the full solution. Um, I do know these light bulbs light up a bit. Um, okay, now my, my thing though, is this is a level eight, but it took Chris thir over 30 minutes to solve, which for Chris it is actually is pretty 90. long. Yeah, it says 90 there. But, um, so I, I think it's actually a fairly difficult puzzle. As okay. like much as I think the eight is like usually in our, our range of stuff we can do. So I don't, just take I don't know. It might be a few pieces. Okay. <sighs> you saw that like there's uh, different capital letters through this. Yeah. I'm thinking that. Has oh, and you, this little you do them in there. there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, okay, more things. This comes with an extra key and some other pieces. And it also comes with an extra one of these light bulbs. Mm -hmm. uh, which I thought was really cool. It has the verification list here of all the pieces in it, signed off with the autograph there by Andy Gilker, the maker. And it's even got a bit well, of the uh, what's up, my friends? story here. So it's a bit of a story at What's Up My Friend. I am Andy Gilker, the creator of the Tesla's box. Thanks for trying out the Tesla's box, escape room box. I hope it will complement a lovely night and keep you puzzled for a while. I've put more than 200 hours on this puzzle on designing, choosing, and making parts, programming, and testing. The puzzle is all handmade, takes 20 hours to fully make and assemble. Ooh. That's crazy, 20 Ooh. hours. The difficulty of this puzzle is moderate and better, sol and better solved from one to three people. Please read the instruction paper carefully and enjoy yourself. After the completion, feel free to display it properly and show it to others. Tag me on Facebook. I'm currently working on a second thematic escape room box, which is much more sinister and intricate. To review, to reward you for trying out the Tesla's box, here's one hidden clue for the next thematic puzzle. Oh, no. So he's got a second one coming out. Oh, I like we don't that. Need that clue yet. But um, save that clue. Put it in your memory bank. This is beautifully made. Like this thing is just awesome. Yeah. Cool. Heavy. These are metal too. Like it's well made. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Do so need anything is plug in right here. Boom. Let's, uh, let's plug it in. All right. So as far as it goes. All, All right. right. Let's test the switches. Flip them. Now in, in playing right. with it, I noticed that when you do Dude, some of these. There's an on off button on this too. Imagine if you just had it set to all. No, that's see. That's you? No, this is, yeah, this is me. So it does. It does weird things like that. I was, I just noticed this before. There's some sort of pattern happening. I don't know. Maybe you had it in four. You just gotta, be, you gotta wait though, I think. I think you gotta wait. There you go. Yeah, I don't know what's happening there. Interesting. Yeah. And then this key, like you said, does seem to come out here. All right. Let's see if we're getting that key out. Should we just use it's the pretty spare loose. key? It's pretty loose. It looks like this piece uh, moves. Yeah. Well. You think it pulls that piece out? Oh, there we go. Yeah, there you go. Pops it oh, out. Oh, a little note. Man. Oh, and there's a little note in there. Look at this. So this, this piece popped out on the end. And there's a little piece of paper inside there that the key pulled out. Do it, man. Pull it, pull it out. Pull it out? Yeah, yeah. Get the note out. Okay. Hold on. There we go. And it says... Oh, baby. Let's see it. Okay. Well, it says US 454622A dash year. 2020. Yeah. For some sort of code. Let's, get to, let's not get too far into this. I don't want to solve this. No. Puzzle. <laughs> no. Oh no. man, I was in for the full ride. Yeah, let's 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 stop there. We don't want to ruin the surprise for people. Well, if you want okay. if you want to ruin the surprise, go watch Chris's video. He has the solution. So this goes in. Yep. There on the front. Slide that bad boy in. There it is. There. Put that key in. There we go. So we showed you the first step, maybe, maybe, maybe. at least a step. And uh, so yeah, Tesla's Tesla's puzzle. Sick. With a second one coming out, I, I, that it gets me excited. Now, we only have a limited amount of these, and obviously with some of these bigger puzzle boxes, they're harder to like 
keep and hold, mm -hmm. but make sure you guys order this if you want one because they are very limited and uh, yep. yeah, they'll be hard to get. They'll be one of those puzzle things in the future that like you won't be able to find anywhere then for like hundreds of thousands of dollars on on Amazon or YouTube or something, or not YouTube, uh, eBay. Mm -hmm. So yeah, Tesla's puzzle box, Tesla's box from Andy Gilker, level eight. Level eight? Get it on the Puzzle Master website. So cool. Yeah, I like that one. Just put that there. Okay, so that is that's the puzzles we're doing today. That's it. Now we have, hold on, hold on. Okay. I, I have I have a riddle. No, oh, don't look no, at it, don't no, look, no, don't okay. look. Okay. I have a riddle for you, Tony. I'm ready. I, I looked it up. I found a good one. Say my name and I disappear. Ghost. Oh, no. <laughs> Words. <laughs> Words. Mm, not quite. No? No. Say my name and I disappear. Why would it be words? I don't know. Words just disappear once they're said. But do they actually like... <laughs> It's a thought. It's a thought. It's not the right answer yet. But say my name and I disappear. All right. We'll uh, keep going. We'll solve that at the end for you guys. Yeah. Okay. Now, online buzz. Let's jump into the online the buzz. Online so buzz. fun stuff. I was going through uh, YouTube here today and uh, checking out some of our different YouTubers out there. Came across a guy named. Now he had a Russian page. No idea what it said, but in his his like one of his handles, Twitter or something, I could see what his name was. His name's Alexei Yakushechkin. I don't know. Yeah, Alexei Yakushechkin. Yakushechkin. There it is. Try again. Okay. So he did a U gear puzzle called uh, Gear Shift or the Manual Transmission. You know what U gears is, right? It's those yeah. flat pack wooden things. You put, push them out, punch them out, and then you make a model that moves. Yeah. This one is actually really neat because it's like a, it's a reproduction of like a manual transmission on a vehicle. Oh, cool! So you can see how it works. So he like shifts it into first, and then you can see the gears. And he, there's a thing you crank, and the gear it moves. And he shifts into second. You can see how it moves gears and then shifts around. So it's really neat. It gives you an idea of how a gear shift works. U gear stuff is awesome, though. If you haven't seen them? Check out Alexi's video. Or check out ours because we've done a couple of years puzzles. Um, they're cool. They're really crazy. So yeah, wood stuff. Very cool. Next was a puzzle or a YouTuber named Joe G. Oh, man, this is like the day of like tough names to say. Joe G. Joe G. Kiba. Kiba did Rubik's magic. Do you know what that is? No. It's just like uh, flat, like s squares that all kind of hold together. You can like fold them and then fold them. Oh yeah, yeah like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. And so it's uh, I don't know if it's actually from Rubik's, but we have like a magic. I think we have a twelve, a nine, 12 panel, one, yeah, nine yeah. panel magic. Yeah. So it's um, on the the squares is like these rings that kind of overlap on different squares. Mm -hmm. So they start out, and I think the rings are separate. And then you got to fold this thing so that the rings all interlock and it makes like a heart shape. I think the puzzle does really neat. Joji Kiba does it. And, uh, I thought it was kind of unique. Um, interesting. Really big in the nineties. You remember having, yeah, yeah, it was big in the nineties. Absolutely. I, I the, the movement on them always amazed me because it's like this plastic with grooves in it and then there's like elastics in the grooves. Yeah. Right. And so then they only allow you to flip it certain ways, but uh, definitely check out that video. It's something different. Um, I thought it was kind of neat, the graphic, how like the, the picture on the front like changed so that the rings were interlocking and it was just really cool. Uh, next, I also checked out a, a video um, by World of Puzzles. Now we've talked about World of Puzzles on here before. They have some really cool stuff and they did a puzzle called Podest by Yavuz Demirhan. Now Yavuz, if you remember right, did the, he's the designer of our, the aluminum line of stuff. Those, mm -hmm. um, like the gold, bl black, um, those ones. The caster and stuff like that. Caster, yeah. Yeah, yeah caster five. Uh, we, what did we give away on here? We gave away one of them. Um, oh, man. Um, <laughs> it's completely. Chiasma. No, nah, we didn't. Uh, no? But uh, yeah, we gave it. Chiasma's in that line too. So yeah, we de designed a bunch of those. Um, and this puzzle is a wood one. It was actually really unique. So it had a wood base and there was four holes in the wood base. And then you got these pieces that were, there's, there's pegs that fit into those holes in the wood base and they stood up and then there was a square piece that was on the peg. So there's a peg here, a square piece, and then inside the square was a cutout 
in different shapes. And so you put those pegs into the squares and stack those square pieces so they they like were on top of each other. And then there is little L-shaped wood pieces that fit into those side, those inside those squares that you had to pack inside of it. Yeah. So it's really unique. Yeah. I'm like, that's really interesting because then there's a lot going on with that. Yeah, one. it's a lot going on with it, and I, I thought it was pretty interesting. So check out that that puzzle by on um, yeah the video by World of Puzzles with the puzzle Podest by Yavuz Demirhan. Um, really nice. good. Yeah. And then last but not least, uh, one of my favorites, Optimal Optimal Review. Yep. I love his stuff. He did Supernova. So nice. good puzzle, good video. Check it out. Optimal review, Supernova. And that's it. It's the end of Online Buzz. All right. All we got today. Make yeah. sure you comment for the rotor. Write your chance to win the rotor. Right. Like for the chance for us to do a video, a puzzle related video in the snow. Yeah, and we only need 75 likes, right? Because we did 25 know, last time. We're giving you another shot to hit 100 between the two videos. So that's it. Uh, Facebook. Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, go to our website, sign up for the newsletter. Like, subscribe to this video, our That's channel, it. get a, all the new stuff coming out. So cool. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. We're out. Okay, time to solve the riddle. If you've uh, watched the end of the video here, you obviously want to see that. So, say my name and I disappear. You thought words? I thought words. You're kind of in the in the right realm of things. Yeah. Um, technically, it's silence. Huh. Yep. <laughs> so as soon as you say silence, silence is gone. Yeah, I get you. That's good. Yeah. There you go. Salt.